Hello everybody, here we are once again with John Collins at the South and City College Birmingham Training Centre in conjunction with QTEC Instruments. So all I'm going to simply do is shout out to all your leads on your KT65DL in conjunction with your long R2 Wonder Lead. Now this QTEC R2 Wonder Lead is 50 metres and to keep things simple, the resistance of this has been pre-made and determined by QTEC at approximately 1 ohm. So that's to help you out when you're doing your testing. So first thing you do is uncoil the reel to the required length, so I've got that there, and I've got my two leads, which come with me 65. So, turn the instrument on, I can push and twist, testing all the time, and you'll see I've got no circuit. I can press the F1 button, and it will cancel, it will cancel the pre-existing nut. I press it twice, so I'll get me greater than nine ohms. So my two leads, I'm gonna get my brown lead, and simply plug that into the back of the instrument, like so. So there that is. And my long wander lead, I'm going to put that into the earth port on the back. So now I've got my two leads connected into the instrument. But that won't give me a circuit. So to simply make the circuit with my original green lead, I simply plug that into the wander lead like so. So now, with my two crocodile clips, the brown probe up, and the green crocodile clip down, I simply make a connection, put it down, wait for the valley to stabilise and all I have to do whilst it's testing is press the F1 button and you'll see it says 0, 0.00 and it'll give you a little tick against the nut. Best practice is once you've done that, separate the crocodile clips, it's still constantly testing, you'll get an open circuit value and all you have to do is reconnect your crocodile clips again and as you can see it gives you 0, 0.00 and there you have nulling and cancelling the null of your lead with your KT65DL.